without taking names, let me explain. Sometimes you have a scenario where you've been blocked, you've been stopped for years on end from even facing reality. So the day the person passes away or the day you're suddenly released, you can imagine what's going to be happening there. Everything haram is suddenly looked at, oh, finally I'm getting this opportunity. Hey, Why? Because you were in a totally, totally blocked situation which was unrealistic. They never taught you how to navigate through whatever you're going to see on earth, whatever you're going to come interact. My little daughter, one of my daughters, she comes to me and says, you know, at school they talk like this and they do like this. I, I, I don't want to go there anymore because, you know, it's so filthy. And I said, you know what, my child, that's the reality. If, if they say those things, you don't say those things. If they're doing bad things, you don't do bad things. And whenever you get a chance, try to talk to them about what to do and what not to do and what's good and what's not good and so on. But if I pull you out of the school simply because of some things you're listening to or you've seen or you've come across that are negative and so on, what would happen? You've had to pull, you will have to pull yourself out of life in totality. You can't just come and tell people, that's it, you know what, it's very difficult and, that, and, and, and there we are. Yes, 